Every year for Halloween, Mountain Dew has released a Mountain Dew Voodoo flavor, which is a mystery flavor inspired by classic Halloween candies. Well, in the year 2022, Mountain Dew decided, you know what? Why confine this to just one year when we can re-release all of the Voodoo flavors from years past? So today, I'm going to be trying every single Mountain Dew Voodoo flavor starting from 2019 and going all the way to 2022 where I will not only reveal what I think in terms of the flavor but also rank them. It's time for the ultimate Mountain Dew Voodoo taste test. So yes, Mountain Dew released the Ghosts of Voodoo Past, which is a six pack of old Mountain Dew Voodoo flavors. Um, they released it on their website as well as on Walmart's website of all places. And I happened to snag one. So when you bought it, it came with this cool little postcard thing, which I'll keep, uh, that talks about the different flavors that came out in Voodoo history. And you get at least one of each flavor. For some reason, I think 2021, you only get one of them but you get three 2020s and an extra 2019. So there's that. But we're gonna try all of them. Uh, and I also still have an extra 2022. So we're gonna try them all in order. We're gonna start with the original Mountain Dew Voodoo 2019. And I'm pretty sure I remember what flavor this is. We'll see how it tastes now. It smells interesting for sure. Mountain Dew Voodoo 2019, bottoms up. Mm-hmm. It's a very sugary sweet flavor. I believe this one is actually supposed to be candy corn. So it mostly just tastes really sugary. Honestly, it's not as bad as I remember it. You'd think a candy corn flavored soda would not be the most desirable, but uh, it's not terrible. Not terrible at all. So now we're going into 2020 with this red Mountain Dew Voodoo can. Let's try this bad boy out. Mm -hmm. So the 2021 is supposed to be like fruit chews. And I definitely get that. It tastes kind of like those those uh, Tootsie Roll fruit chews kind of mixed together. It's just a very sweet, fruity candy. Now we're going to go back to last year and try Mountain Dew Voodoo 2021. I remember I liked this one. Definitely has more of a chemical-y flavor than the other two. I think that one's supposed to be like gummy candy. So we have candy corn for 2019. Fruit Chews for 2020, and then Gummy Fruity Candy for 2021. Then of course we have Voodoo 2022, which they have not revealed the answer for this one yet, because it's still Halloween time. I believe this one is gonna be like Red Pixie Stick, or something like a sour cherry candy, because this that's exactly what this tastes like. It has the flavor of like Sour Pixie Stick or um, the the cherry version of Fun Dip. It's like a tart cherry. So they're all good in their own different ways. Ranking them is kind of tough. And honestly, I know I just said I like this one, but I think 2021 might be last. Just because of the chemical-y flavor of it. Let me try a little sip of the older ones one more time. Let me try this one one more time. Okay, so I have officially ranked all four of the Mountain Dew Voodoos. We're gonna go from last place to first place. I don't think this is gonna come as much of a shock. Last place is 2021, because even though I think the fruit flavor is good, it tastes very chemically. It's, I mean, granted, I know it's supposed to taste like candy and candy is very artificial, but it just has this very chemically flavor. It kind of tastes like cleaner of some kind. Not my favorite. It's not horrible, like it's drinkable, it's definitely more drinkable than the uh, the really terrible gingerbread one from last year. Um, but not my favorite. I don't like the chemical -y taste. Third place is actually 2019. Um, candy corn is a very odd choice for a soda. It, again, it mostly just tastes really sweet. It's overly sugary. I don't know if the candy corn flavor really vibes well with the tropical citrus flavor. It does taste a little chemical-y. Not as much as 2021, but it's odd. 
I definitely don't think that one's gonna be for everybody, but it's better than 2021. Second place easily is gonna go to 2020. This one is very drinkable. It's got a nice fruit flavor. Doesn't taste nearly as chemically as the other ones. It's pretty solid, pretty solid. And honestly the best, 2022. That tart cherry flavor works really well with Mountain Dew. Obviously, you know, Code Red is one of the most popular Mountain Dew flavors out there. This just tastes like if you made Code Red sour. So if you like Code Red, you'll definitely like Voodoo 22. So there you go, that is my ranking of all four Mountain Dew Voodoo flavors that exist so far, including 2020, 2019, 2021, and 2022. How will 2023 go? We'll have to find out next year. But that is going to do it for this episode of Taste Test. And it is our final episode of Halloween Spooktacular 2022. I'm glad we were able to do a lot more this year than we did last year. So thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed all of our Halloween themed content. New videos on this channel air three days a week unless they're bonus videos. So hit that subscribe button and click the notification bell. That way you know when new videos drop. Now that Halloween Spooktacular is wrapping up, that means... It is almost time for Holly Jolly Holiday, where we're gonna be getting into the Christmas stuff. And uh, let me just say, I already have a uh, Christmas flavor food item that I already filmed a video for. So, should be starting up not too long. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time on Taste Test. Bye. <laughs>